The goldenrod animal lancet from MediPoint has many advantages over other bleeding methods for mice. No anesthesia, surgical procedures, or restraint apparatus is required. To use the goldenrod animal lancet, first prepare a collection vial so that the vial can be retrieved quickly when blood flow starts. Then tear open the individual goldenrod lancet wrapper and withdraw the sterile lancet, laying it on the paper wrapper so that it can be retrieved with one hand while not corrupting the sharp sterile point. Hold the mouse securely by the scruff of the neck so that the animal is immobilized. The location of the puncture is easy to find. It is located at the rear of the jawbone. We are aiming for the lower portion of the facial vein that drains the eye, the rear portion of the submandibular vein, or the junction of those veins and the jugular vein at the rear of the jawbone. Once the point is located, quickly apply enough pressure to poke the cheek of the animal to the depth of the point and then withdraw the lancet. These veins offer a much larger target area than with retroorbital bleeding and are much larger in diameter, offering a faster flow of good quality blood. Blood flow will start instantly, so have the collection tube nearby. In these demonstrations, we are using a BD microtainer tube, which is readily available from Fisher Scientific and can be purchased plain or with separation gel or anticoagulant. For your convenience, there is a link to Fisher Scientific's microtainer webpage next to this video on our website. Blood flow can be stopped at any time by applying a compress to the puncture site. In this demonstration, we missed the first drop, but still collected a half mil of blood, although we could have stopped the blood flow at any time by applying a compress. Always be careful that the amount of blood collected is within the PHS guidelines for the size animal you are using. You will notice that the animal is unaffected by the procedure. Because the goldenrod animal lancet only makes a small puncture wound, animals can be bled daily or even hourly if only small quantities are needed by alternating cheeks and targeting a slightly higher or lower location than the previous puncture. Using this method, the animal is alert and suffers only incidental and momentary trauma, specifically the stick with the lancet. Using inexpensive goldenrod lancets, one or two drops to a half mil of blood can be quickly and easily drawn without hurting or losing the animal. As soon as the animal is returned to the cage, it is alert and active. The blood tube can now be processed. Shown here is the half mil of blood that was collected from the mouse we just returned to the cage.